Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our English class. Today's topic, capital letters. For our starter activity, choose the correct word and group them in its proper place. Here are the list of words on the yellow column. Put them in the right place if it's a common noun or a proper noun. Get your paper and a pencil and try to answer the activity. Pause the video now. Time is up. Now let's reveal the answers. Here are the answers. For a common noun, we got month, lunch, and crocodile. For proper nouns, we got Mars, River Nile, Eid, Snow White, and Manchester. What have you observed about the names here? in the proper nouns. Great observation. They are all written in capital letters. Remember, all proper nouns are the exact name of person, places, object, animals. So they are written in capital letters, while common nouns are written in small letter because they are general term for people, places, things, objects, and animals. Our learning objective for today is to identify and use the capital letters correctly. Here are success criteria. I can identify words that should start with a capital letter. I can use capital letters in different ways. I can write sentences using words with capital letters correctly. I can write a paragraph using words with capital letters. When do we use capital letters? Time to think, pause the video, and do your reflection. Time is up. Here are some information for you. Where should we use capital letters in our writings? First, in starting sentences. When we write sentences, we should capitalize the beginning of the letter in the sentence. Capital letters are always used to start sentences. For example, he loves to eat cake. Letter H in the word he is capitalized because it is the starting sentence or the beginning letter of the sentence. Another one is if we are writing proper nouns. Nouns are naming words. Proper nouns are naming words for individual people, places, days of the week, and months of the year. Proper nouns all need capital letters. They are the exact name. For example, for common noun girl, it's Helena. Country, the proper noun is Australia or other countries. For city, we got New South Wales or Abu Dhabi. Soccer team, we got Daintree Rainforest or other soccer team that you know. And for day and month, we got Friday and February. Another way is use capital letters when you are writing I. A personal pronoun I. The personal pronoun I always needs a capital letter. For example, I can tell the time. Letter I as personal pronoun should always be capitalized. Now here's the activity for you to have some exercise or to have more practice about writing or using capital letters. Underline the word that should be capitalized in these sentences below. Pause the video and write down your answers in your paper. Start. Time is up. Now let's reveal the answers. All right. Letter I on the beginning of the sentence. It is always snowing in Iceland. Letter I for Iceland is also capitalized because it's 
a name of a country. I like going to Sydney. Again, I, personal pronoun. Sydney is a city. Chris and Jen went to the shops in Melbourne. Chris is the name of a person as well as Jen and Melbourne a place. When I was a baby, I didn't have any teeth. W for when because it's the beginning of the sentence. I personal pronouns are capitalized. My brother Zach and I watch football every Saturday night. M for my, the beginning of the sentence. Zach for a person and I personal pronoun and S on Saturday because it's the name of the day. Now I'm sure you know already how to use capital letters and I'm very sure also that you are ready for our activity. First, let's have our self-assessment. How do you feel the lessons? You find it quite easy. Smile. Part of this activity were difficult or is it very hard or difficult? Now, for us to find out, let's have the main activity. Worksheets are uploaded on the assignment tab at the MS Teams. Answer the activity there. So we got three worksheets there. Task 1, Task 2, Task 3, and one challenge worksheet. We want you to choose which task that you can do best. Work on at the MS Teams assignment tab for your answers. I will leave you with this activity now. I want you to proceed to the MS Teams assignment to work on with your task. Thank you so much. Enjoy learning and always remember, be the best you can. Bye.